today I'm going to make this a guitar pick. Let's get into the project. So here it is, I've cut across here and across here, now I'm just going to cut across here. So I went into my sister's room and took out one of her two guitar picks to use as a template for my own guitar pick. So I'm just going to put it like here. Okay, I like the look of that, now I'm just going to trace around it. And if you haven't already, please subscribe and ring the notification bell. It helps me to make better content. Thank you. Well, here's the rough shape now I'm just gonna get it down to the line more with some files and rasps. Okay here it is it's gone down to the line quite a bit more now I'm going to make the mould so the epoxy doesn't go everywhere when I, pour, when I pour it. So let's make a tinty winty little epoxy mould. And the best way to figure out if this is hot or not is to do this. Yep, that's definitely hot. <laughs> Here it is. Now I just need to mix up my epoxy, put some pink pigment in it and then pour it. The moment of truth. I've got my epoxy. I'm going to open up the mould, prime it, get ready to pour and then I'm going to pour it into this container, put my pigments in and then put some food dye in. So let's do that. Cross your fingers and hope that the epoxy doesn't dry before I can pour it into the mould which is right here. into a problem here. This one's open but this one isn't. I have to quickly open it before it dries. Okay, I've got them both open now. Let's pour it back in. Okay, we've got it poured out. Now I'm going to mix it around. Here it is. Going to the more blue. This is now heating up and swelling up and there's steam coming off it. It's really weird. Well, that was a fail. First attempt failed. The whole thing just swelled up. And then steam came off it. Toxic fumes probably. And then it just dried on here without even getting in here. I'm going to try again with no colour and hope that it works. I'm applying heat so the bubbles pop. There are toxic fumes coming off us right now, so I am going to move away and then I'm going to wait 16 hours for it to dry. So, one Mississippi, two Mississippi, three Mississippi.
here it is. Um, now I'm just going to sand it a bit more and then I'm going to varnish it. And then let's see if I can make some nice music with this. Well, here it is, the guitar pick. I can just imagine me strumming away here. Well, now I'm gonna show you how it works on the guitar. Hopefully it stays together. Well, let's see if this strums without breaking. Yeah, it works, which is really not cool. I'll hear a few shots of what it looks like and I'll see you back on next week. Bye.